and welcome one and all citizens to um, another base tour video but uh, so if you've been watching the streams here in Outlaws of the Old West you've uh, you kept up with the fact that we've built this huge um, complex we have houses spaced all out we have the big temple on the hill people build all over but we went with a dock style base the dock stretches all the way around had a lot of fun with it it's got a little work to do yet, but we're having building issues lately since the last patch. It's kind of lagged it out. So we'll just start and do a quick walkthrough. Not going to keep it anything too fancy. I'll show you the upper levels of the trading post. The lower level is a buddy's house, so we're not going to go in, into their house personally. But um, we like to sort the houses out. Like We like to put up the... Uh, I'll show you guys. Because uh, I have a community of friends I play with. And I'll show you guys what we do to, to annotate private space versus public space um, it's it was a pretty good idea I enjoyed it but we've been working on this uh, whole setup here since the last reset we'll go ahead inside I'll show you this real quick so we do the um, the jail gates to annotate that it's it's private space this is all his all buddy of mine's private quarters uh, so that's pretty cool just and we have a mutual respect there. If there's a gate and we know we're not supposed to go through, there's some gates that are meant for other reasons. But uh, if we know we're not supposed to go into it, we won't mess with it. So let's do a walk around here. Uh, this is the main dock, the community dock. It does stretch down this way. I'm probably going to push it further event eventually. But that leads over yonder to another buddy's house. That's uh, another buddy's little cabin. We were not, we're not going to go over there, though. It's pretty dangerous. A couple of bears and a couple of wolves. Not in the mood. So, uh, pretty much all the main crafting tables and stations, it's all shared, all community, right through this area. The big water tower is awesome, by the way. I really enjoyed building up that one. Let's go ahead and go down. And we'll check out the first dock um, structure here. It's just uh, storage. We kept it spread out because these things are so big. This, the, these bins are all mainly for more basic items like stone wood uh, planks all that good stuff and next up is the um, party dock which we built this yesterday pretty cool place I actually like this spot quite a bit I don't think we have any wood left yeah it's it's a little glitchy right now but I could put um, the fences up here so we did rope all the way around. Looks pretty cool. So you got the fire, the booze barrels, the chairs, just to sit here and chill. I mean, it's, it's pretty neat. It's pretty neat. I liked this. I, I liked building this yesterday on stream. But, uh, oh, my horse is doing that follow thing again. Every time I log in, it resets the follow. He'll be stuck a while. So next up, we're going to take a, de a detour here. This is the armory. Still a work in progress. Want to move a few um, workstations into here. And just all the guns we find that are public we'll put in here. Kept it a little separate on purpose. Over here is the original dock, and this was much bigger. I actually shrank it down quite a bit. But this is a real uh, the original dock that we built in the area before we wound up moving over there. Just left this in place as homage to the first dock. A bunch of tents here because we do have we do have some community members in and out. So if they um, if they just need a quick spawn. They can grab a tent. I think all these still have all their spawns remaining. Had fun getting these up. And yeah, so we, if we have new buddies coming into the community or whatever, it works out nicely. Uh, next up, we have the goat there. Oh my lord, if you all watch the stream, that goat is never ending. So we just have the auctioneer, the, uh, the gold exchange, the very loud death goat, the bank. And we'll be talking about the bank here in the near future. That's a newer building. actually do a lot with that that's good so then we have the oil pumps three mines and each mine is a unique instance from what we've found out so far so pretty cool setup let's head back to the dock we'll go from there and yes the lag has gotten bad recently I noticed that the lag got worse when the first mine went down and subsequently the whole area got laggier uh, after the next, the next two mines went down so we might have to wind up taking two of those mines out or at least move them, since we're so close to the edge of the zone, I might move them into 514 to try and deal with the lag. 
But moving on down the dock here, guys, we have like the distilling area. Still a work in progress, but I just wanted to get this video done before everything went downhill with whatever the next reset's gonna be. So next up is my house. Just uh, just uh, since I like to use the public dock space, I um, made my house real small. I do have the bed for the respawn point in my house. Uh, it's still, I want a few more aesthetic things in it, but the the main thing here is just my my private stash, which is um, at this point pretty substantial. I've enjoyed um, filling up my stash with goodies. Um, I never break down things to bars anymore unless I'm going to use the bars. And that is just due to losing so much on the furnaces lately. And I, at this point, also babysit the bars being cooked so I can pull them off uh, quickly if I need to. So next up, we're going to proceed to another buddy's house. I don't think he has like a private lock space like we've done yet. But he is like the leveling center. He has a lot of uh, grinders. Upstairs, I think he has a lot of sawmills, so this is just paper and sand. Just, um, just for leveling, more than anything, because you get good experience from all that. So, uh, that's still a work in progress. I think he's he's enjoying the levels, as you see on level 19, so I do put a lot in there to grind quite often. The dock continues on down to my next buddy's house, and his house is really nice. He spent a lot of time on it. Uh, I think he did very well with it. He's still working on building down. He wants to build closer to the dock. He did good here, too. He was able to stretch his, his deck out a bit more again with the triangles. That's new. Looks good, man. I've not been through here before, so yeah, really nice and open. It's actually laggier over here than it is over by my stuff. I wonder why that is. Oh, well. But then he's got all his loot and stuff here, and then next up is the, uh, the temple. As you can see, uh... The roof and everything there looks great on it. I wonder if you can get up in that little little building. I bet you can. I wonder how. So this is the first thing I built over here, the big uh, footbridge. Just linking the zones a little more together. It was the first thing I ever built. It was really fun putting this in. Kept it simple. Looks good. Very happy with how it turned out. And then my buddy also added more stairs across. Now the downside to building on rock lately, there's a spot like right there that's really deep and glitchy and things will spawn in it and fall through it and it's just it's just bizarre so this is the temple it's it's um, a very unique construction I like how it turned out quite a bit he's got some lamps up there how do you get up higher there and can you get into the top of it I, I come over here quite frequently but I don't know if you can get up into the top or not I'm gonna have to ask him I think you can so this is like the whole prison area, lots of loot. He kind of made that for me, he said. I wonder, yeah, there we go. Let's see where this goes. I don't know if you can get in it, but I love how the, the top of the temple looks there. It looks like maybe it's closed off, but very cool. I really like how this building turned out. Nice door there. Then the downstairs, let's take a peek real quick because it's been a little bit since I've gone in. I think the downstairs was kind of converted as the upper levels were finished. Yeah, as you can see, it's all closed off. This used to be all open space. It was pretty cool, but he did a good job putting it together. And now let's move on. We're just going to overlook from here. We're not going to go any further. So down there's the last log cabin. Over there, buddy's built one more thing. But there's a bear like right in there normally and then there's all those wolves. I don't feel like dealing with all that today. But uh, yeah guys, it was good fun. So this is just a full community area. We took over a, a full lake out in um, a sector pretty well, far away from everywhere else with the hopes that the lag would not get us, but obviously the, the lag. And I think it's related to the number of things we've built. Although it doesn't feel like we've built much. I've been to other areas that are not this laggy. So I think definitely the la latest patch did something. But yeah, guys, really enjoyed this build. Uh, the best part for us is the public dock. And how we just kind of have everything gathered up there. The you know, the trading post, the public dock. All the additional structures we've built for uh, practical purposes around the dock. Had a lot of fun building this. Uh, 
and I think in the future we're going to keep this general style. And I think with every reset we were talking about the other day, we're probably going to wind up back at this same lake building again because we do like the setup so much. Very nice lake, lots of resources, lots of materials. Pretty, pretty much no want for anything besides the fact that the lag has gotten bad lately. But, and then this was the dock extension that I did just the other day. And we're going to follow it back around one more time just so you guys can get a general overview again. I'll be railing this off eventually. But definitely, really had a lot of creativity here. Um, putting the dock in, we'll do that a video on that here in the near future. It's pretty easy once you get it started. And it's a lot of fun. So if you all have questions on how to do the dock, how to get the pillars in the water, just uh, leave a comment. And I'll see what I can do for you guys. But anyway, anyways, guys, we're going to cut the base tour here. Really enjoyed showing it off. I just, I, it, n nothing, nothing, uh, not everything, excuse me, is completely done yet. But um, I want to get a video of it at least before a reset happens. And I, I get the feeling that a reset's in our near future. But y'all take care and have a great night. And thanks for uh, following through here to the end of the video. Y'all take care and good night.